Hey man, what's good? It's your boy Cartier B, and today I'm about to be putting you guys on my personal accessory collection because yes, I know I always preach accessories this, accessories that. You need accessories to go with your fit just to complement them and make them that much better to be honest, you know what I mean? You people how I just pull out the accessories, I always got the accessories on me, you know what I'm saying? So pretty much, I'm just gonna be going over my collection, showing you guys where to buy them. So without all the talking out of the way, stay tuned and let's roll the intro and let's get it, man. Let's go. All right, so I know in every single video, bro, not in every single video, but dang near every single video, I'm always preaching, I'm always talking about accessories this, accessories that, you guys need accessories to go along with your fit, it makes it just that little times better, it pulls your fit together. I know I'm always talking about accessories, but I'm never showing you guys my accessories really, or my whole accessory collection, or where to buy them from, and I thought I may as well make a video on it for you guys because I don't want to always keep preaching about accessories, but I haven't put you guys on fully with my accessories. So that's today's video. Now let's just kick it off with the necklaces or not. Nah, let's, we'll get into the necklaces. Let me tuck these, you know what I'm saying? And then we gonna get back to these. But first we gonna start off with the rings. So a big thing about accessories is just gold and silver you know what i mean you could do leather black whatever but the main two components for accessories in my opinion are gold and silver you gotta figure out are you more of a silver type of dude or girl you know what i'm saying because that's gonna want to be the majority of your rings so me personally i am more of like a silver type of dude i don't know why i keep saying type of dude whichever one you like more and fits your aesthetic so i'm personally more into silver so i have a lot of silver accessories so right here like we just have a bunch of silver accessories we have this one with the smiley faces on it if it'll focus in and i don't think that is focusing in but yeah right here we have this one with this kind of like green crystal on it. I think that is pretty cool. We have this one with the smiley faces around it. So this one right here, the green ring, I got this in like Grass Valley or something like that. You could go to any like local jewelry store to find rings or necklaces. This ring right here, I used to wear this one every single day and it just has smiley faces around it. I used to think that this was so, so tough. It's still tough, don't get me wrong. But as yet, I don't know if you can see, but it says Maple in there. This ring in specific, if you want it, go to Maple Co. You know what I'm saying? I know there's a lot of YouTubers and y'all be wondering what accessories they be wearing and like where they get them from because they're super tough. But they'll never tell you exactly where they get them from. I'm not one to gatekeep, you know what I'm saying? I'm here to put you guys on. That's the only reason I'm here, you know what I'm saying? And then right here we got this ring that I wear every single day, man. As you guys can see, it has this kind of like swirl through it. So pretty much my friend Zay, bro. Shout out Zay. Zay always showing love, bro. I, if you're watching this right now, I love you, Zay. No cap. No homo, though. Mm, you know what I'm saying? So, boom. He gave me this ring for, like, $25, bro. This is actual gold and silver. He got out of swap meet over in Hawaii. I've personally never been to Hawaii, but it looks dope. And I don't even know why I put that in, but you know what I'm saying? I just want to go to Hawaii one day. But, yeah, he got this in Hawaii, and he sold it to me for $25. I love this ring. I wear it every single day. It's not too, like, big or bulky. It's just slim. It's slick. It's a cool little accessory, and I put it on, and I just feel better. You know what I'm saying? I feel more put together when I put, like, accessories on. So that's also a good thing. And then right here, I got my mom's ring. It's pretty much just silver, and then it has this pearl in the middle. Anyways, let's just get into the bracelets. I don't have too many bracelets, but right here, as you can see, I have my apple watch and then this brown leather bracelet has these kind of crystal stones in it and then some like uh like tassels and stuff on it my dad made it for me so it's super special special it's super special to me you know what i'm saying 
I love my dad, obviously. I love my parents. So it's super special to me. It holds a dear place in my heart. Now, next up, going along with that, I'm going to tie it back in. But it's this Gucci bracelet right here. It just says Gucci on it. I mean, it doesn't say Gucci on it. I probably would never buy something that just says Gucci on it. Like, bro, it, it's cool. It has a nice little, like, thing to it. It has a skull in the middle. GG. I don't know. It's like the GG, like, Gucci skull ghost collection or something like that. But I think it has a cool little, like, rock star type of font to it, I guess. But I like it. It's silver and I wear this a lot too. But what I'm saying is this right here, I'm wearing this right now. This is just like leather or whatever. Like this is not expensive. This is very, like, it's pretty expensive. I don't know. I don't really remember how much it is, but Gucci, expensive, right? This typically not expensive, right? So why am I wearing this over something that is expensive? Because this is more like custom and more of like a dear place in my heart because my dad actually made it for me and he's not into fashion at all. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, he is not. So that's just like super cool that like he saw, okay, I'm into jewelry, accessories and stuff like that. And he made it for me. So obviously I'm gonna pick this over the designer. You know what I mean? So what I'm saying is, you don't have to have the most expensive stuff just kind of have your stuff kind of hold like a little meaning in your heart and it just makes it super much more cooler to wear i guess now i actually don't have too many bracelets the next one right here is this like wooden bracelet it has japanese like script writing through it and it just says where your will lies is where your success lies. It's supposed to be like a good luck type of thing and then the other ones i do have a couple in there but those are broken and I'm not gonna show you guys something that is typically probably gonna break on you because it broke on me. So I'm only gonna show you guys the stuff that I know is like good. Next up, let's just get into the necklaces. This, I did run this down in the five back to school essentials. This one is just a chain with like a little tree in the middle. And then this one is the golden cross in the middle. Now these two chains, I wear these every single day without fail. Like I go in the shower, I don't take them off because this is silver, this is gold. It's not gonna rust. I don't take either of these off, bro. Both of these mean a lot to me. And then next up right here, this also has a super special meaning in my heart, but I don't wear it that much just because it is like kind of like really expensive. So right here, let me focus it in on you guys. So right here is this cross. It has four diamonds around the center on each end of the cross right here, 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 here. And then those are diamonds. And then in the middle where it's kind of like blue is all sapphires. So I'm not gonna wear a diamond and sapphire cross every day. This was my grandma's. My grandma did unfortunately pass away. So this has a lot of meaning in my heart and I'm never gonna sell this or give it up. This will always be in my collection. But not to speak too much on that, next up right here is this pearl chain. Now, I've got this pearl chain and everybody was like, yo, Ben, why are you wearing pearls, bro? Are you, mm, like, which way do you swing? I'm like, bro, what are you talking about, bro? Like, they was tweaking. So now everybody's wearing pearls. I guess that's just the way that life goes. Go get yourself some accessories. And it's Cartier B. I'm signing out. Catch you boys in the next video. No cap.